Hey friends, welcome back to Bitfumes. I'm your host Sarthak and you can also call me Ankur. This is a channel where I talk about the Laravel and the cool thing about the Laravel. So if you are new to this channel, don't forget to subscribe. So in this episode, I'm going to show you the Markdown Mailable. label. Okay, so let's see what Markdown Mail label is. Before that, I want to show you something. I just want to send an email. Okay, and obviously we know that we have created this route and everything okay mailable system okay so this is sending email you can see i got the email here this is the email but what if i want the email which is very professional that means i have a heading have a button have a panel have a footer okay for that letter will provide you much more thing let's see what i am going to show you before going ahead i will just create a new mail label by going to my command prompt and I will type php artisan make mail and the na mail name is new mail and now what I'm going to do I'm going to create a markdown okay and it's markdown <laughs> okay and the name of that markdown file will be let's say email and now when I hit enter, let's see what happened. You can see it says mail created successfully. Let's see what this markdown has created for us. Here is your resource folder and here is the view folder. And in view folder, you can see this email.blade.php has been created. From where this is created? This is created by this markdown system. So you can see I have given the name email and that's why it will create the email dot blade dot php and let's see what is inside this file you can see there is much less content and but this much less content is going to make your email very professional let's see what the mail system has been created so we go to the app folder the mail folder here's the new mail this is the mail label so this is a new mail label and this says markdown email Remember we have created here like this. We are not going to share this view. Now I am going to share the markdown. Okay. Let's see what the other thing we have to do. Obviously we will go to our controller and the mail controller and you will see we have created this mail. Okay. Now instead of this send mail, I will say new mail and obviously we have to import that new mail also. Okay. That means now we are sending email with new mail mailable inside that mail folder. So obviously we have to give the two part that means to whom we are going to send this email. We are going to send the email to bitfumes.gmail.com. Okay, that's good. Now try to send email. Let's see what happened. Slash send and it is going taking time for five and yep done let's see this is the email and you can see here there is a panel which says laravel there's a button button text the body of the message introduction and the obviously the thanks part and the footer and you can see here let's go to the email.blade.php created by the markdown you can see here is given introduction and this is the introduction part. Now, this the body part, the body of the message. This is the body of the message. You can see component mail button. It create a button and this is the text for the button and text for the button. And the last thing, thanks, obviously the app name, which is Laravel. But you cannot see the Laravel header and the all right reserved footer. Where is that comes from? Obviously, we cannot change these things from this system. So we have to do one more thing. But before that, I'm going to show you the more components of the markdown. For that, let's go to the documentation of the Laravel. And here you can see in the markdown system, writing the markdown so we have seen the message part this is the message component we have seen the button component also we have not seen the panel part let's copy this and paste it here okay 
and the next thing is table we can also include table inside our email dot blade dot php that means inside our markdown and you can see i have given the panel i have given the table and let's see is there anything else no now let's try to send the email two three four five and yep our mail is arrived now you can see here this is the panel content and this is the table we have given here so you can see how much easy it is to do all these things with the laravel markdown you can see it's look like professional email the email from a big company you know we can provide many of the panels many of the buttons we want the headings the header footer anything we can change okay so this is much more easier okay obviously you can change the color of this button you can change everything for the changing i have told you we are going to change the header and the footer path so let's see how we will create that thing for that we will going to run this command let's run this command let's see what happened with this it says published completely that means the part of the component which is inside this folder is now transferred or copied to this folder so where is that you can see i will close the app folder in the resource folder in the view there is new folder called vendor and the vendor has mail folder and the mail folder has this markdown so you can see the button component is coming from this okay the panel component coming from this okay so this is the component part and for the html part here is the html and you can see the button is actually the html button is from here this is the button okay so i want to show you how to change this uh, header and footer so let's go to the header part let's see where is the header header.blade.php and you can see here is given the slot the header and how will we change let's see in the markdown no in not in the markdown in the header 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 let's say bit fumes and try the same thing now you can see in the header we have the bit fumes similarly we can change the footer also so we will go to the footer and in the footer i will just say bit fumes and obviously we cannot going to show this so we will comment this out go here send email again and check that email this is the new email arrived and now the footer is bit fumes only so you can see that we can easily create the markdown and professional looking like uh, email with the help of markdown and we can also edit the part of this email the part of this markdown system so this will in your hand in your this will show you the creativity what you can do with this email system you can obviously make you can obviously do much more things i encourage you to please go and read the documentation it is fabulous and if you have any problem in the documentation reading so please feel free to comment me if you have any problem in this episode then also feel free to comment me okay and you can follow me on twitter facebook instagram you can message me there your problem your suggestion and obviously your views okay and share this video with your developer friends so that everyone get the knowledge of the best thing called laravel and please don't forget to subscribe that is most important thing and we will meet in the next episode till then bye bye